Hello again viewers, just about midnight we're going to go down the British Square in Benidorm and I'll pre-warn you, I'd recommend probably adults only for this video who knows what we're going to see when we go down here I'll show you some bars on the way so we've got the Hotel Orange right there in the heart of the action and I always find a wee reminder of St Murn, the Buddies Bar in Paisley the wee Buddies Bar just behind me, quite a popular bar, well known um, for entertainment just behind me here on this wee road so we're going to take a walk down, let's see what Benidorm is like midnight in the area that's predominantly really geared for younger people um, we've got some nightclubs coming up here we've passed by some places that have moved premises and used to be here this is one of the most affordable bars in this area a pint of Heineken, one euro eighty pint of vodka and Red Bull, four euros fifty um, Corona, three euros pint of Strongbow, three euros pint of Guinness, three euros I don't know if that's draft or cans, don't know. Either way, it's probably not bad, is it? Uh, they've got various drink deals here. They've got happier, two for one in local mixers, four euros fifty for two drinks, spirits and local mixers. They're doing food as well. They've got a wee takeaway place at the back and sit in. Now, Benidorm regulars, you will recognise here or just down here. Hello! <laughs> the Birdcage. Now that opened not a few years back now. Um, and they were doing a lot of good entertainment and they were right next to Sinatra's. And it was a good spot for live entertainment. Now everybody's going to remember Sinatra's here, a touch of class. They've moved just down the road to a new venue. Um, so these two bits are empty now, which is a bit of a shame um, on this trip. But we're going to head down, prepare yourself, viewers, I have warned you, hold on, before you do anything else, first of all, prepare yourself, we're heading down here. Second of all, new viewers, hit the wee subscribe button, it's absolutely free, I try and show you everything I possibly can when I go to these places. You'll have seen some scenic videos from Benidorm, where I show you absolute beautiful places, especially in the Old Town. Now we're going to go to basically the madness of the British Square. Here is another wee bar in here. The Saturday bar. But it's Sunday, so there's no dinner. It. <laughs> it looks nice, eh? I don't know if it's part of the Hotel Orange. I don't know. Always, it's always a mystery to me, the Hotel Orange. Um, like how you don't hear the noise from, from all the, the bars here, but maybe you don't. That's it literally in there. <laughs> if you're staying in the Hotel Orange, you're next to nightclubs. I've a few people commented saying they don't hear anything when they stand there and I've heard a few other people saying they have stayed there and they have heard a wee bit of noise so let me know in the comments if anybody stayed in the Hotel Orange it's a brilliant location if you think they're going to uh, nightclubs here I don't remember this from here last time so I think it's maybe a new bar, Camden Town looks quite nice, got a big screen at the back um, more of a relaxed vibe here, without a doubt see we've got table service, somebody getting cocktails, somebody getting shots there um, so maybe a new, a new bar there, we've got a few other bars around here and, and here we go viewers, here we go prepare yourself now, I've given you a pre-warning we're going down here, past Champions past Cafe Benidorm, Cafe B as you might call it get a zebra crossing here, it's optional for these cars, they just completely ignore it <laughs> okay thanks so, Cafe Benidorm, pretty famous here, open very late tonight, everybody heads in here late at night. Champions, next door as well. It's a Sunday night, so it's going to be busy on a Friday and a Saturday. Still quite a lot of people, this is, this is still quite early for this trip, midnight. We've got the Hippodrome, as I said, you will see some dancers in these places. Uh, Bahamas. So, I have three warned you viewers, I have warned you. We've got the beach coma, just on the right hand side, this has been here for years. I think I was in this about 30 years ago honestly. Um, couldn't tell you really what it's like, can't remember. 
So these are the main discos. All the cabaret bars, all the good entertainment are, are on the strip. I've just came round from walking by Western Saloon, Morgan's Tavern, all those sort of places there, a wee bit further round to the left. So this wee bit I've just passed here, it's really aimed um, at the younger crowd. Unfortunately, I'm probably past that stage now. Um, <laughs> to be fair, but you will see a bit of a bit stage group we're up to. It does surprise me sometimes. Um, maybe they're up to the Hotel Arms, don't know. Now, we've also got Chaplin's. Again, they've got adult entertainment, as you can see. Chaplin's is just straight on there, on the right-hand side. We've got Broadway across the road. Broadway across the road. Rose and Crown, Queen's Arms. I've done another video up there showing you all the strips, so I won't go up there again. Let's go down this way. So as I said, we've got Chaplin's down there. Promenade and the Beach just down there as well. We've got the Zodiac Show Bar. They've got Elvis on, various other things, a Queen tribute. Quite a well-known bar, quite popular. A few other bars down there as well. Let's head on a wee bit. Three warm you viewers, I have warm I'm gonna show you everything. Various different clubs here as well. Somebody trying to speak to me now, they better move on viewers. Probably the best eh? <laughs> I passed here earlier on. A couple of Irish bars on the left hand side. You'll notice with Benidorm, a lot of the bars um, have got big sports um, sports setups like TVs outside and stuff like that. That's the Dublin House. Round to the left we've got the Shamrock. Looks like a tattoo parlour, still open this time. I always find it interesting, tattoo parlours open past midnight. <laughs> Must be hard to make a decision if you've been out all day and stuff like that. Um, Hotel Marina over here. I've stayed in Hotel Marina, um, party central location. If you're going to the nightclubs, going to the bars around about here, you'll love it. Be prepared. Depending on the room you get, you could you could have noise till early hours of the morning. My room ended up actually fine. I got a good deal on it. I couldn't complain. One of the best TV screens in Europe, I believe. Um, that's a pool. That's a big TV outside it. So pretty tremendous. There's big sport events like World Cup, European Championships, and that. All the games on there, this place is absolutely jam packed. You'd have seen it probably on YouTube before. Um, so, good venue for party goers. Looking for a quiet, relaxing holiday, you're probably going to head up to the old town where I'm going. Um, there's quite a lot of shows in there actually. And they've got the famous Beatles statues here. Planet Benidorm across the road. gets quieter as we come down here. Here in the corner we've got Andy's Simply The Best. We've got Jurgen Klopp talking about his famous victory over Man City earlier. <laughs> uh, as you can see, brilliant new statues here. So, we've got a list of entertainment here. Brilliant entertainment. Queen Tributes, Adele Tributes, Elvis. Um, Amy Winehouse, Eurasia, Bruno Mars, Tom Jones. Absolutely brilliant. Something for everybody in Benidorm, without a doubt. These places are getting a bit quieter now because as I said, it is approaching midnight on a Sunday night. Andy's simply the best. It's probably busier during the day than it is at night. It gets lively um, during the day, especially if the weather is fantastic as it was earlier on. It was about 25, 26 degrees earlier on. It's got a bit cooler now, it's maybe 21, 22, a wee tiny bit of wind. This is a new bar here. Wasn't here last time, can't remember what it used to be called, but anyway, it's called the Funky Flamingo Bar. I passed it earlier on, it was actually very, very busy. You got the road viewers. Scruffy Murphy's on the left. Jumping Jack's on the right. Again, big TV at the end. Perfect. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what, what is this? TT bar. Buy one drink, get one free. 
<laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Promise you're for me. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> well, viewers, we did get an offer there. <laughs> buy, buy one drink, get one free. I did pre warn you before we started this video. I did put the camera there away to be fair, most of the time there. <laughs> So I'm heading up that way. I could go down that way to the promenade as well and then go right. Let me see how so much down here. Yeah, I might head down this way actually. I'm down the promenade. Stick with me now. Don't remember this bar been here last time. Could have been here for ages, no idea. Tipsy. But um don't know if it's busy inside or that busy outside. Tipsy Parrot, Benidorm, Enigma. Quite a few people outside this Enigma. It looks nice inside actually. Um, it's a gastro lounge place. Okay, so a wee bit more of a cooler vibe. They've got a DJ in the back there. Maybe really busy on a Friday and a Saturday, not sure. Two ways I can go here, I can go right all the way along here. Might do that or I might just go along to the promenade and walk along and see what's happening. I'll wait and see. <sighs> Pretty tired but I was going to stay out a bit later and maybe watch a wee show but done in last night. Youth Hostel, the Leds has done me in. To say the least. We're not sure these lights actually. We've got lights coming up. You still with me? Thanks so much. Appreciate it. Well, still with me, thanks a lot. I feel as if walking home in these late night walks, I've got somebody with me. If I'm doing these videos, we're nearly at the lights here, hold on. Bulldog pub on the right. Pretty new, wasn't here last time I was here, don't think. Mm, maybe it was, don't know. Can't remember. Belroy Hotel on the right hand side, quite a good location this hotel because it's kind of in between um, yeah, in between Newtown and Old Town I wait till you see these lights at the end Okay, we've got some walk of life going on over there So that's the Belroy Hotel over there and then we've got all these nice lights heading into the old town. So if you ever get lost, you find the lights, you know you're nearly back towards the old town. I think I'll be maybe, hard to tell, 10 minute walk from where I'm staying just now. I'm staying up at the church in the old town. Um, there's not going to be much open between now and going up to the old town. There will be a few bars open in the old town, I have found a bar in the old town up until four in the morning, the yellow submarine, but that's a bit, that's still a five, 10 minute walk away from where I am, and I'm not going in tonight. Uh, thanks so much viewers, I really appreciate it, um, for staying with me on this wee walk, there's Cafe Paris over there. We've got the 10 pin bowling on the left hand side. Um, Ten pin bone on the left hand side and then there's a kind of kids activity centre next to it but obviously been past midnight now <laughs> it's not going to be open for yours. The ten pin bone looks as if it's still open but let's see. Surprising. Yeah. The bowling's still open. I'll tell you something the electricity bill will cost a lot of us to hit this place hard. Look at the lights in here. So the bowling's still open. I've done another video showing you inside there, looks like good fun actually. Um, there's not going to be much else open up here. This bit is definitely shut now. But it's amazing to see the lights, isn't it? All right. Viewers, if you've watched this to the end, you are a superstar. Thank you so much. I really, really appreciate it. Pretty tired. I'm nearly up at the hotel. <sighs> nearly there, viewers. I was going to get a taxi and I thought, nope walk it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, something a bit different. 
Don't forget, hit the wee subscribe button. It's absolutely free, it does not cost a penny. And give it a wee thumbs up. I'm heading to the old town. Wish me luck. See you later, viewers.